and now we get a peek at some of the top players here for this Madden Ultimate Team matchup. Brandon Gauden, Charles Davis ready to go in the booth. We hope you're ready to go at the controls. Let's play. Team. Fielded just outside the goal line. And he's only going to make it to the 13-yard line and no further. the 13 now they work on first and 10. They'll start by running the option to the right and whoa he's going to hope that that is not a sign of things to come. A rude welcoming to this ball game. A bad start there a big loss on their first play from scrimmage. It's second down. to throw here he's gonna loft one deep left side here and that gonna be incomplete good effort there trying to take a shot but it's third down and I don't think this is the script they had in mind for their opening drive this is third and long they're gonna look to throw he's gonna let it go again well this is taken in it's complete and all the way down to the 37. It's a big play there for Vegas. Every defensive staff harps on limiting explosive plays. Job not so well done there. Yeah, they talk about it all the time. A lot harder to stop, though, isn't it? And when you think of an explosive play, most offensive staffs define them as passes of 20 or more yards and runs of 15 or more yards. They went zooming past that number there. The last run good for two. Here's second and eight. Handoff, Lindsey running left. It's a room to maneuver. And he will score. Touchdown, Las Vegas. Philip Lindsey, 35 yards. And the Raiders have taken the early lead. Throughout the game, we're going to track so many different statistics, but one is becoming increasingly in vogue, explosive runs, runs of 20 yards or more, and we just saw one right there to open this game. Now we'll see how the other team responds, because when you get a play like that against you this early in the game, you got to feel like your back's against the wall a little bit. Yeah, the pressure now increases on you because your first thought is we have to answer right now. After the touchdown, here's McManus now to kick it away. Taking it about the one. And a nice return sets him up pretty good here right at the 30-yard line. So first and 10 now from the 30. And he's got a good gain of seven up to the 37. A nice run here early on. It then took a great play call to realize you want to establish a guy of his caliber with runs like this early because they'll pay dividends as the game progresses.
good run. Got seven on first. Here's second and three. Back to throw. Henry. He's going to wind up and air it out. Oh, and this ball's tipped and intercepted. Picked up by Janoris Jenkins. And the Raiders are going to get it back here just shy of the 20. What a start defensively. Your offense goes out, gets the touchdown, and then you get the interception. Just perfect. How about the discipline that they showed on defense? Because after the offense scored to go up 7-zip, you would think they might be a little... And got his man complete! Touchdown! Brandon Marshall, 81 yards! And the Raiders are able to strike quickly for six. Extra point from McManus is good. And that'll make the score 14 to zip. After the touchdown, here's McManus now to kick it away. Oh, trying to gauge the sun, and he muffs it. And a nice job there on special teams to limit him to inside the 15 as he's dropped at the 14. The Panthers out there and ready to begin their next drive. And following the interception, we'll see what they can put together on this drive. I hear my old college coach right now. He always used to tell us before every game, the team making the fewest mistakes will win. What they're hoping is that that last mistake is their only one of the game. Coaches, that's all they talk about, turnovers, right? <laughs> Minimizing those and maximizing opportunities. And a short gain here across the 10 to the 12. Play action. Henry on the move to his left. Slings this deep from McLaurin. Oh, he tries to force it in, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Janoris Jenkins. Shedding the tackler, and it gives him some room. There he goes, left side. And he takes this one back into the end zone, and the Raider defense delivers a score. Partner, what we just saw, that's a great example of a team that was really amped up. They've been playing so well, yet they didn't get overexcited and have a bust on defense and gave up a big play. Instead, they created their own big play with a pick six. This one may be over. Yeah, it's just the first half, but that lead has swelled to the point where you're wondering if it is over already. McManus's point after is good, and it's now 21 to nothing. So how about this for a start? 21 nothing here in the first as they kick this one away. Taking it about the one. And a decent return out to the 27-yard line. This Carolina offense at the line, ready to go. And they gave up the pick six, and now they'll be looking to right the ship here. Now, as a quarterback, are you a little more cautious this go-around? You should be, <laughs> just because after what you gave up. But you can't be so cautious as to just really take things in, and now you're not going to play loose enough to give your team a chance to score. But you still have to be careful, because those defensive guys, I know the reputation defense guys can't catch. All evidence to the contrary on that last possession, though. <laughs> So the big play changes the complexion of things. Here's first and 10, just outside the 30. Off the play fake. Henry, they'll roll him out right. And they'll get this one to about the 20-yard line. 
containing him is becoming a big problem. We've already seen this once earlier on this drive. Yeah, and so now two times this has happened. Do you adjust something? Yeah, I think you do. I think you have to start thinking about your rush lanes. Try not to either get too wide or too narrow. And he's wrapped up. Taken down. Back at the 25. Jack Youngblood in there to get him. It's a loss of five. From the gun, he'll hand this off. And he'll get him inside the 15 down to the 14-yard line. From the gun, they'll try to run it. A loss of a yard, and it brings up fourth. And no move to get the offense off the field. They're going on fourth and five. Operating from the gun, Henry. Being chased out left. And for the third time here in this half, it's intercepted. Picked up by the Michigan man, Jabril Peppers. 30, 10, oh, and he takes this one back into the end zone, and the Raider defense delivers a score. That pick six extending this lead even further. And boy, it's been a while since I've seen a team struggle this badly in the first half. I think all they want to do is get to the locker room, try and regroup, and come out to start the third quarter. But things don't improve fast then. I think the backups get a lot of play in the second half. And now the kick is away. And here comes a return from just beyond the goal line. And ultimately cannot get this out to the 25-yard line as he's dropped at the 23. Panthers out there and ready to begin their next drive. And following the pick six, and they have decent field position in throwing that pick six. We'll see how they attack this drive. And I think all you say to your guy is, listen, let's just take care of the football a little bit better. Make some better decisions on this drive, and they'll probably help him a little bit with maybe some really high percentage throws early to let him get settled back yeah, in. But they told him, and they told us, they've got confidence. That, that's not a problem. Yeah, not a problem at all. They just want to make sure they get things settled down a little bit for their offense and give their defense a little bit of a chance to rest. We remind you that coming up at halftime, Jonathan Coachman will be alongside. He'll have highlights and analysis from Orlando of this first half of action. Steps away to his left. The catch made by DeAndre Hopkins. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. This offense finding its legs now. Here's another first and ten. Looking to throw. Henry escaping the pressure right. He's going to look deep in zone for Hopkins. And it's intercepted at the goal line. Picked up by the Michigan man, Jamil yeah, Peppers. Yeah, and the Raiders are going to take possession here. It's a touchback, and they'll take over at the 20-yard line. 